can't talk to you? Oh, son of a bitch. I'll, dr I'll bring him back inside. God, God damn it. Who would have known a dead a dead guy is a turn off for, for women? For women, who would have known? Fucker. Can you get up? Oh, did I glitch? Did I glitch her? Get, get up! Oh my god. This is gonna suck. Oh, let me go back inside. Go back outside. Dead body. Yep, she's glitched. Fuck. Damn it. No, oh, it sucks. Well, don't do what I did. Man, I've been not stupid. Why would she get creeped out if I bring O'Malley? <laughs> uh alright, let's let's stop fucking around. Let's actually do this fucking mission. Come on, load. The hell? It's a weird loading screen. What's <laughs> up, baby? So? What happened? He looked a bit tired and it made him grumpy. He's asleep now. <laughs> grumpy? All that's left to do Knocked is his fucking ass cup. out. <laughs> I've always liked your style, Jensen. I know I've said it a couple of times already, but... He fucking kung fu chopped his ass. You've done a really good thing today. It's been a pleasure working with you again. Just like old times, eh? <laughs> good luck with... Well... Whatever it is your cute ass is working on these days. <clears throat> Thank you. Sweet. So that's... That's the last side quest. You want to get that over with because... Um, once you do the next mission, you cannot go back here and do the side quest. It will delete it, and you will lose out on experience. So, once we're done with that, let's head over to... Uh, Seraph Industries. You know what sucks? On my other playthrough, on my inventory, I have nothing. Like, I am broke as hell. I have, like, one bullet for my trank, I have... Two stun gun darts, and I have no ammo for my combat rifle. Like in this playthrough, I have so much shit. I might, I might switch my playthroughs. I might use this one. I like, I might save over this one, and use this to play, continue on. Cause this play, this run I'm doing right now on this save file, it's pretty damn good. I have a lot of shit. Come on, man. God. Loading screens up the ass. Okay. So, let's head on over. Let's go talk to Prickchard. He's all the way on the third floor. Is that my office? Visions? It's kind of gay. Why does it have, like, a freaking red box around it? Prickchard. Make sure you talk to him first before you do, uh, anything else. I think there is uh, something here, is there? Oh no, there's whiskey or wine. Fuck that. It sucks to this guy. What do you want? As much as I hate to admit it, I need <clears> your help. <throat> that signal you shut down in DRB territory. It's been active for almost a year. You're telling me someone outside this company has had access to our network since before the first attack? I yep. detected intrusions before and shut them down swiftly every time. But whoever designed this particular algorithm is good. Very good. You've told Seraph? He's good! Here's the thing. The intrusions were possible because of a backdoor access into our security system that I never even knew existed. The one Sanders team used to get inside our plant. I've worked here for seven years, Jensen, and this is the first time I've seen that particular access route. David Seraph created it, specifically to bypass the firewall. He's hiding something, and I think you should find out what it is. Oh, God. 
Because, as far as I can tell, Sarif created that access and was streaming a lot of data through it shortly after your ex-girlfriend suggested he hire you. All right, so our boss is hiding something from us, which is fucked up. Let's go talk to him. Serif Industries. That's pretty cool. Oh. Well, hello, boys. Who the fuck is he? Who the hell is you? Excuse me. Mr. Jensen, isn't it? Sir, you have that charity dinner? In a moment, I said. What the fuck? <laughs> Why did he sound like he had to take a shit? <laughs> Sir, you had yeah, the charity dinner. Yes. Yes, I imagine you do. <laughs> As David Sarah's top oh security man, I imagine what you have the file on me. Oh, God. The voice but acting in this game is sometimes you, so funny. Jensen, I am devastated by recent events. Really? I do not support what you and your company are doing to mankind. I believe it's extremely dangerous. But abolishing human enhancement technologies will only be achieved through legal means. I'll keep that in mind. This is your first day back since the accident six months ago, isn't it? Sir, we have to accident? go. Accident? It's not a fucking happened? accident. There was no it's accident. Plan. Oh, my mistake. But it Dumbass. must have been stressful facing down a second incident so soon. I imagine it brought That's back all asshole. kinds of unpleasant memories. Oh, uh, my memories are none of your damn business. I appreciate your concern, but it was nothing I couldn't handle. I appreciate your concern, Mr. Taggart, but it was nothing I couldn't handle. I'm a psychologist, Mr. Jensen. I know when a man is hiding behind words. The flesh may heal, but the mind is not always fucking, so resilient. He's a fruit. You might want to keep that. You are a mind. fucking fruit. Now, man. if you'll be so kind as to excuse me. Bitch. What was the point of that? Your ball you got balls coming here. What makes you think you'd be welcome? I paid question him. I'm curious about something, Mr. Taggart. What is it you hope to accomplish by coming here tonight? I would think that would be obvious. Your company has been viciously targeted. The violence and bloodshed that's occurred, it, it must be stopped. But I'm afraid it won't be until men of wisdom and understanding come to an agreement. About what? About the future, Mr. Jensen. This enhancement technology threatens to change the course of human evolution, to redefine what it even means <clears throat> to be human. You think governments can afford to let that go unregulated? You can't stop progress, Mr. Taggart. Perhaps not. But neither can we afford to sit by and watch it happen on its own. Not when we have the ability, the collective will, and foresight to influence it. I see. Thank you. For illuminating me. I don't, I don't understand. I don't understand why he's talking about controlling uh, augmentations when really people. It's, some, some people have a choice, you know? Who is texting me? God. Oh my fucking god. <sighs> I'll be back. God damn it. <laughs> 